Awesome. Go check it out, guys. Alex Cars, what are you bringing? What goodness are you bringing us from the uh, fine state of California? Well, uh, late last week, I was listening to the Art of Wrestling podcast with Colt Cabana. Mm. And the episode on that was actually a preview of a series that, uh, I guess a mini series, I guess you'd call it, that he was that he has on a, a service called Howl, uh, Howl Premium to be more specific, or at Howl.fm. Uh, and off the back of his uh, preview, I decided to check it out, uh, and it's actually pretty cool. So there's a lot of like different kind of mini series and specials, comedy albums. Uh, there's I, uh, the, the plan is for all of the archives of like Gear Wolf and Wolf Pop, although for some reason there's some technical difficulties or something, so the ad free archives aren't quite available yet. But so far, what I've checked out on the service has been really cool. Um, I went ahead and listened to the three episodes of uh, Cole Cabana's Pro Wrestling Fringe, which is uh, the mini series that he has on the service. Uh, I also checked out his audio documentary on the Gathering of the Juggalos, which was very nice. interesting to listen to. Oh, I, I, uh, I need to check that one out. <laughs> yeah, it's it's really good, and it's kind of funny because he originally he originally recorded the documentary long enough ago that his little audio tag at the end for checking his stuff out, uh, he still directs to his old uh, URL of welovecult.com instead of colcomanda.com. Um, I also listened to, because it was the featured episode on the site, and I think it still is, uh, Mark Maron's interview with President Obama, which was actually really, it was a really cool conversation to listen to. Um, and then I, the last thing I checked out was uh, uh, Sinbad's Make Me Wanna Holla comedy special. So a nice variety of, of content on there. And it was interesting kind of for the aspect of, uh, so it's kind of a, a subscription service. And I guess the plan is uh, $4.99 a month. Uh, you can get you can sign up for a free week now, or you can get a special code from different places. For example, the Art of Wrestling podcast had a special code to let you get a free month. Nice. So, yeah, so it was, it was very interesting to me because, um, like, the idea of actually charging, like, a subscription rate for podcasting just because, you know, it's interesting, like, kind of with the shift in how people do, uh, basically do business with podcasting. And uh, also, this is a service cool. where it's, you know, Mark Marin is kind of the premier podcaster at this point. I know, I think this is the service where it's his back catalog, you said, right? Uh, yeah. You know, when you pay for it. So that's that's some really kind of high-end stuff. And and we're talking, and, and you also get access to to albums like Al Magical, Aziz Ansari. I mean, these are established mainstream pretty much names and just a lot of great comedy otherwise. Chris Hardwick's even a part of this. Um, yeah. um, uh, there's a lot of recognizable names. So these are quality people you want to listen to, interesting things. Um, I, I think that's worthwhile. Now, for me, I, like I saw it and I kind of scoffed a little bit at the $4.99 because it's like, I don't need another subscription right now. <laughs> yeah. But it is, so it is something that is, okay, am I going to listen to it enough? And it's comparable. If you have a hole in your listening slash watching schedule around, um, around, you know, all the Netflixes and Hulus that you pay for then I think this is great. And, and I know a lot of people that are big, big, big fans of the Earwolf podcast, of a lot of these uh, comedians. And and I, me as just going in as maybe just a wrestling fan that maybe wouldn't seek out a lot of this other stuff, I'm not sure. But man, I think it's a pretty good thing they got going on here. And and I, I listened also to the, the, the preview episode uh, they had of, of the uh, Pro Wrestling Fringe. I'm really interested in that. Like it's, I'm really fascinated. Oh, yeah. Um, in my day to day, I'm, I'm kind of running into a lot of public radio people. Um, mm -hmm. and I really do see that as more of an audio art form than what we do around here. And, and I have a really big appreciation of that more and more these days. And I'd love to hear you know, like, like, uh, like the Colt Cabana thing, you know, is doing that, that audio storytelling, not just, you know, discussions and conversations, which I think are awesome in their own right. Right. Uh, obviously we're doing it right. Um, yeah. But I, I, I'm very interested in that, and, and I don't know, maybe one day they'll inspire me to do something along that line, too. But Yeah, uh, um, yeah I also wanted to uh, mention, because I was, also, like, with, with, with that, I was also checking out the uh, app that they have for it. 
uh, it's been it's been pretty cool so far. Like the app, like obviously, like you know, lets you get to the content that's available on the service. Which and so I was checking it out, and I remember the first like when I was thinking about using the service, the first thing I wanted to make sure I could do on the app was to uh, download the episodes onto the phone so that way I can actually listen to it because I don't have very much way in, in the way of uh, internet up here. So right. it was good to be able to download and be able to listen to this stuff later. That's so, good. The, 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 one, like, the one weird thing about it was when I was listening to something on, on the app, uh, the little notification thing that lets you kind of play or pause it wouldn't go away after it, even after I quit from the app. And so they did a, they actually just had an update for the app, like as of like today or so. And I think that might have fixed it, but it was, it was, it's definitely been, it's, a, it's been a pretty good experience with it so far. You're going to have that, especially with new services like this. So, and, oh, yeah. and I mean, geez, Stitcher, I, I just did a recorded a basic sorgonomics that went up this morning about uh, how Stitcher has failed me by being down for four days. And that's a service that's been around for a while, you know. Uh, yeah. So maybe I'll talk about that at some other point, too. Uh, but anyways, um, uh, awesome. Go check it out. How.fm. I, I think I'm probably I'm going to at least uh, uh, probably get that code. And uh, try out the free month and, and listen at least to the to the wrestling stuff, get a, get a feel for it, and see if it's worth my uh, four ninety nine. Uh, but at least get the start of it and check it out. I think that's awesome. 